Civil society groups, local and international, have been observing the Governor and the State House of Assembly elections. Issues of voters' turnout, insecurity, anarch preparedness, electoral violence were raised during a briefing with the media in Abuja. In some places, there seems to be low voter turnout. In other places, there is large voter turnout. And I think this will depend on a number of things. Uh, we don't want to make any conjectures yet about the reasons for the deviation, other than to make the very general one that it, it, it depends on local dynamics. In most of the polling units, we have seen destruction, most especially in Lagos. We've seen that things happen and then uh, our security agencies started reacting and not uh, being proactive. So, and most of these people didn't even want to call with their phone because it's it, it also very obvious that they are calling for help. And in some instances, we also seen some of the security agencies uh, posted at the polling unit are uh, trying to just let go because of the safety of their own safety. The exercising, you know, that passion, that drive that we had, we saw during the presidential election seems not really there this time around, you know, and probably people have get, got the solution, people are scared, or that element of distrust, you know, is now coming back. Yaga Africa received 15 confirmed reports of vote buying across eight states. In Sarkin Mudupoli Unit 016 in Giade local government area of Bauchi, PDP agents have been cited bribing accredited voters with a thousand naira. The group also advised on security arrangements for voters and need for security agencies to sit up. We have gone through this over and over again. So we need to say what we think needs to be done. We don't want to get to a point where we'll then have a special security agency for election. Our security agencies are all deployed from the DSS to the police who are in charge of election to the military, Navy, uh, um, Air Force, they are on civil defense, road safety, all of them, NCDC, they are all deployed for this election. Customs and all of that, so they are all deployed for this election. So if we have all our security agencies deployed for the election, it's about the coordination, it's about the security agencies being neutral and being responsive. They also made recommendations for future elections in the country.